Watch till the end to know the best way to convince your parents to buy you Robux. In this video, we'll talk about how to convince your parents to buy you Robux on Roblox. Slap that like button and hit subscribe for more Roblox goodies. Let's go! Number 6. Make your parents look good. Whether they admit it or not, your parents are concerned about how they appear to others. Adults frequently feel scrutinized for their parenting abilities. So any method you can assist them in feeling confident as parents is beneficial. So when you're out in public with your parents, put on your grown-up clothes. Make courteous small talk with their peers. Answer their repetitive queries in the most fascinating way possible. Make a positive impact on the social scene. Believe me when I say that proud parents' hearts and wallets will be a lot more open to your wishes. Number 5. Ask for Contribution Mom, I'm in desperate need of some Robux. I need them for this educational game about astronomy. I've learned a lot from it already, and I think I am really interested in astronomy, so I want to expand my knowledge in this particular field, which would help me in my school projects. They're $50, but I don't have that kind of cash. Can you help me with the remainder if I pay for half of them with my babysitting money? This is a template of what you could say to your parents. This request comes across as grateful, responsible, and as if you're a kid who understands the worth of money. Mom will always certainly purchase it for you outright. Number 4. Earn the Credit if you want mom or dad to purchase you anything small, simply ask. However, for a larger purchase such as a car, laptop, gaming console, and so on, a more methodical approach and patience are required. The most important thing you'll have to show them is that you're grown enough to deserve whatever it is you want. I'm not sure why this is, but it appears to be the case. Make a list of modest tasks that will make you appear more responsible and complete them. Offer to take on little responsibilities and always follow through on what you say you'll do, plus a little extra. If you demonstrate that you want to contribute to the family and that you are not resentful of your obligations, you will begin to be seen in a new light, a more mature light. When that happens, you'll have a lot better chance of getting what you want. Number 3. Be the solution, not the problem. Sometimes we all feel abused and deserving of more. We really are at times. Being mature, on the other hand, sometimes means being content with what we have. By the way, many grown-ups don't seem to grasp this concept. As a result, reduce the amount of drama. If you're being treated unfairly, don't bring it up unless it's blatant. Be the mature one and let it go when a sibling starts something. All of this contributes to a sense of trust and credit worthiness. It also serves as a foundation for the inevitable sure I'll get that for you. Number 2. Don't force them. When parents are pressured for time or feel rushed, they are significantly more likely to respond no rather than yes. So any major asks should begin with something like this. Dad, don't answer yes or no right now. I'd like to consider it before responding. This will allow dad or mom time to think about what you want, as well as make you appear more mature by demonstrating that you can wait a day for a response. Number 1. No doesn't always mean no. So you requested something and they declined. This isn't ideal, but it's also not the end of the world. Try to figure out why. Determine why you were rejected. And then ask what you need to do to make it a yes. If you get an unhelpful broad response, probe deeper. Okay, you want me to be more mature? That is something I would like as well. How am I going to show you that? Your perseverance will most likely not be annoying or interpreted as a challenge to your parents' authority. 
Rather, it will be viewed as an adult method of taking responsibility and pursuing your goals. And that wraps up the video for today. That's all for me today. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And if you guys could hit the like on this video and turn on notification. So when I upload next, you guys get notified would mean a lot. Also, if you guys could hit the big red button and subscribe to my channel, it would be great. See you guys in the next video and peace.